So the, the difference here is that my phone will connect directly to the driver's phone. Whereas normally my phone will go to the server, server to the driver's phone, driver's phone to the server. There'll be some sort of middleman. In this instance, I'm connecting absolutely directly with the driver themselves. Yes, nobody else in the network exists but you and a series of drivers. That series of drivers is selected by your phone. Okay, and the benefit and of that? Well, it's a direct connection. There's, a, there's a, again, the same benefits over and over again. The same benefits of safety, security, privacy, plus you can then open up an encrypted channel between them and talk and, you know, normal phone call. Uh, nobody else knows what's going on here. You and the driver are in an agreement. And the second you, you the cab would arrive, then you have this lovely thing where you can make sure with a little logo it'll tell you you're looking for this person and it shows you their face and also shows you a special code which your phones can see and the reason for that is some people used to get into the wrong cabs and one poor young lady yeah. got killed by getting into what she thought was her cab but wasn't so we, there's mechanisms for that too once you sit in that cab this is where it starts to really get interesting as you sit in that cab your phone then contacts a number of your friends silently and everyone knows this is happening it can be uh, five of your friends and if anything were to happen or anything were to go wrong the entire record of what's happened your position and location is continually being broadcast to just your friends not to a central server and other people which but a lot of people wouldn't allow that because they don't want their location being known to other people but when you've chosen a group of friends that provides another level of safety so at any point if anything goes wrong you've at least got a straight button you can press to emergency and they'll be notified or in co of course because this is a decentralized marketplace and there are no companies limiting what can happen you could even subscribe to security services that's important for certain people in certain locations so that when they get in this cab and the, the exchange begins and the drive starts security services know exactly where they are all the time and again, that is that person's phone doing that work, straight out. How do you mean that? that that's that person's phone doing that a work? A phone is a computer. A phone is a computer. It's okay. a full working computer. So that phone is doing the work of broadcasting. As opposed to a server would be doing it right As now. As opposed to relaying to a server and the server relaying, relaying it out again, which is something that could be done again, but we're just eliminating all the unnecessary things. This is what needs to happen. The fastest way to get the data from your phone to the people who need it is directly straight across the network to those other and people. what if my battery dies or something whilst we're in well, If your battery dies, your battery dies. If your battery dies, then oh, in this current system as well, you don't have a signal. So uh, it will also be able to send the signal of the driver's phone, who can also, you could also simply have the driver's phone do the same thing. And it can do that, it can do that without knowing who those friends are, so we're not betraying the privacy of the friends. Again, this is all correctly done.